Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new episode of the Pokemon Blue Nuzlocke here on Coach Max Entertainment. I am Coach Max and you can find a brand new episode of this Nuzlocke series every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Whew, guys, it has been a hot minute since I recorded one of these. Also, I'm just going to go ahead and tell y'all right now. I have played through uh, Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow a good few times since uh, doing all these YouTube videos. And the first time, I think I picked up uh, Flash, but I have not used Flash on any run since then. Also, excuse me, I just burped a little bit. We are going to be encountering something new, and I'm not trying to force some faint faintings happening, but I, I do want the Nuzlocke to be very eventful, so I will not be healing by leaving and going outside of the Pokemon Center, or the, the tunnel, to heal any. Any healing will be done inside the center, or inside the rock tunnel. So, who knows what's going to happen. I hope y'all are having a great day today. Uh, I just got to tell y'all, the other day was when I had... Oh, Newt was not a good idea. Oh, no. Okay, headbutt will be fine. Uh, the other day was when I hit 500 subscribers on YouTube, and guys, that just blows my mind. I can't believe that. But also, the other day, as in just a few days ago, was whenever... Oh, my the game froze. There it goes. Whew. Sometimes my uh, emulator just does that. Uh, it's Visual Boy Advance. I'm not sure why. I have to, like, click on the screen. It's weird. I don't know why. But uh, the other day I hit 600 subscribers on YouTube. And, guys, that's blowing my mind. We are... I never thought that I would actually get close to 1,000. Also, here's going to be our first friend. Oh, no, it's not, because we already have a Zubat. So we are not going to be getting a Zubat here. I'm just, I'm so grateful and thankful for everybody. Uh, if you didn't see the last upload, it was, well, there was an episode of the Nuzlocke, but the latest upload was, ah, uh, we're getting a Geodude. Alright, dude, cool. The latest episode of the Nuzlocke was the episode where uh, I beat Lieutenant Surge and got to Rock Tunnel. Ooh, keep using Defense Curl. I'm really just trying to uh, get him to flinch. Because, actually, I'm going to growl him a whole bunch. Uh, I only have one Pokeball. Oh, that thing has Rock Throw? Guys, if Geodude has Rock Throw, we may uh, may want to add him to the team. Rock Throw's not a, not a terrible move. Its accuracy is uh, not good. There we go. But I want to I wanna make sure I catch one of these. I hate losing catch encounters on Nuzlocke's, but anyways. Long story short... We're legitimately on the road to a thousand subscribers on YouTube, and that blows my mind. So thank you all so much for your continued support in that in that adventure. Ooh, that is not doing anything at all. Hmm. Let's bring in Looney Luna. Looney Luna's a tank. She took down Lieutenant Surge all by herself. If you didn't see that, but the last episode uh, or the last video that's an actual video, was the Pokemon uh, Can You Beat Re Yellow with an Abra. And guys, that was legitimately a tough challenge that I was not expecting it to be. Come on, poison it. <sighs> Great. Uh, I was not expecting it to be as tough as it was. Uh, it was a little easy once I got Psychic, but getting up to Psychic was the worst part. That part was miserable. All right, Luna, poison it. Oh, come on, Luna, off that critical hit. Uh, I have a new video coming out this Sunday, just a uh, sneak peek into the future, and uh, it is Easter Sunday, so we might have a might have an egg themed run. I'm not confirming or denying that, although I just mentioned it, so yeah, we pro we're gonna have an egg themed run. Uh, but you might be shocked at what the game is gonna be in. It's uh, not red, blue, or yellow. Uh, which is a very big departure from what I, you're used to on this channel, that's for sure. There's one thing I wanted to talk to y'all about, and that's quitting in online matches. 
the other day while I was playing Pokemon Go, I was playing the uh, PvP Battle Arena, Battle League, whatever it's called, and I was winning. I was about to beat this guy, and he quit. And so, I just thought that was weird. He, I still got the credit for the win, so it's not like I was cheated out of a victory. But it just... Something about it just rode me the wrong way. And I remember one of my friends, I would get so mad at him. I We got Geodude. Uh, let's think about what we can name Geodude. Rocky, for sure. Dwayne. Uh, the Rock. Let's see. We will... I like The Rock. You know what? I don't know if I've ever actually seen this specific nickname. I've seen plenty of nicknames of Dwayne or something like that for Dwayne Johnson, but we're actually going to call him straight up The Rock. I think that's a cool thing. But one of my friends, he, what he did, he would play, uh, it was Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3 on the Wii, which, oh, that's such a fun game. But what he would do, he would get on there, and if he was going to lose a match, he would just quit. And it was just, come on, Millicent, really getting confused. I See, I want to, I'll swap in Green Pikmin, even though he's got confusion. And the poison would get crushed. Oh, please don't. Okay. See, that's about what I needed to happen. So let's just vine whip through this thing and be done. Oh, I was expecting that to be more of a one-hit kill. Oh, please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Whew. Thank goodness. <laughs> oh, guys, that was, uh, that was a little scary. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Oh. But uh, he, would, he would quit out of a match if he knew he was going to lose. And in, in that game, you got credit for if if the other person quit in the middle of the match. But it just made me so... I don't know. I felt like it was the lamest way possible to, to lose. Uh, or to, to leave a game. I don't know. It, bother, it bothered me way more than it should have. We'll just leave it at that. We'll just leave it at that. Guys, I've really gotten, uh, so recently, well, let me tell you about what I've been playing the other day. I don't just play Pokemon games. Uh, I have been playing the Spider-Man game on PS4, which if you own a PS4 and you don't own Spider-Man for PS4, you are wasting so much by not playing it. It is one of the best games on the PS4, for sure. It's one of the best games that's come out recently. Like, there, I have, have no, no problem making that statement. And I love Spider-Man. Spider-Man is, in like, definitely my favorite superhero. I don't know if it's just all the material that there is with Spider-Man. Anakin is up to level 24. Anakin is a, a nice little Fero now, for those that didn't know. Uh, but just all the material with Spider-Man, the great shows that were out when I was growing up, the movies. Guys, I love the Tobey Maguire movies. Uh, like, I grew up with those. So those will always have a good, special place in my heart. Ugh, come on, Anakin. You got him. There we go. Good job, boy. But Spider-Man on PS4, it, it has one of the best stories, too. No doubt. One of the best stories. Uh, I just finished it on uh, a run on ultimate difficulty and on ultimate difficulty what you do is you have let me think of who I need for the next gem uh, Luna wouldn't be bad let's swap her up front um, but the story is phenomenal great the story is phenomenal in Spider-Man on PS4 and that's one of the best things about it that's for sure. Also, during this quarantine time, I have been watching a ton of movies on Disney+. Plus. There was one day, I think I watched about eight movies. Uh, it was just while I would... I, I was playing, doing the Abra run in the background. Um, 
just having a movie going up on screen while I was watching that. I think I started in the A's. Uh, I watched Ant-Man, Doctor Strange, A Bug's Life. Uh, what did I watch for C? I watched Civil War. Just so many different movies. And I've been watching DuckTales, the new version of DuckTales. Oh! Learns body slam. That's why. So, okay. Guys, let me, uh, let me tell you about this. Some of the uh, comments I've been getting are about how, hey, I should use these TMs. You are absolutely right. I j literally just remembered why I hadn't been using the TMs. It's because Looney Luna, our good old Nitto Queen, learns, uh, holy cow. I did not expect that attack to do that much damage. But uh, Luna learns Body Slam naturally. And so that's why I didn't use that one. Uh, I did look it up. Newt Sand Slash does not learn any ground moves naturally, though. So I'm probably going to want to use the Dig TM on him at some point. I really should have uh, packed my materials better than this. Uh, oh well. well. We'll keep Luna in there, especially now that she's got Body Slam. Uh, there's one hiker up here, but I'm pretty sure I can avoid him by just going all the way up at the top. Uh, the video for this episode is going to be fantastic, <laughs> just in case you wanted to know. Uh, but the DuckTales, uh, new DuckTales show, if you've not watched that, oh man, guys, it's a good, good show. Uh, I remember a lot of people... See, I was never huge into DuckTales. DuckTales was about the time right before I got on to uh, Toon Disney, uh, as it used to be called. Now it's Disney XD, and it's sad. It's not sad. I, I don't want to hate on something that is... Uh, part of somebody else's childhood. Okay, I avoided those people. But I was not part of the uh, DuckTales crew. I watched a ton of Darkwing Duck, but Tailspin and DuckTales I missed out on. I'm not sure how. Uh, Goof Troop I missed out on a little bit. Goof Troop was just never on TV. It was one of those weird ones. And Chippendale Rescue Rangers. So Chippendale and, Duck and Darkwing Duck were my main, my main ones. But I always liked DuckTales. But the new show on, uh, it's on Disney XD, but all of the episodes so far are on uh, Disney Plus. You should really give it a try if you've not if you've not gotten into it yet. It is so so good, and there's an overarching story through the entire entire series, which is really really cool. That's something they've started doing with a bunch of reboots: is taking the original show that was really good and just adding in a lot of extra stuff with it. Oh, don't disable Body Slam. Oh, Scratch, whew. Thank goodness. Whew, we're gonna make it through this. Uh, one thing that, uh, I, I have a list of things to talk about during Let's Plays, during this, but one thing that I did not write down about DuckTales is the DuckTales game that is available on, it's available on a lot of systems actually. I have it on 360 uh, downloaded, and there's one achievement in it that I still need to get, and it's beating the game on the hardest difficulty or whatever, and you have to do it all in one go. And that's just, it's one that I just haven't done yet. But what I'm probably going to end up doing is streaming that. Uh, once I get to a thousand subscribers, assuming that everything just doesn't blow up and the world ends or whatever. Uh, also, there's a very good reason why I put Wayne up front. You'll see here in just one second. Uh, this guy has been annoying. Let me tell you about this guy real quick. He has a two Geodude and a Graveler. Well, those two Geodude and the Graveler all like to do a certain move called self-destruct. Did I really just use bubble instead of water gun? Take it out, take it out. Ooh, thank goodness. <laughs> Got a little worried here. I used bubble again. Guys, I'm just not paying attention. Let me talk about something other than the game, and then that way I'll pay attention. But the DuckTales game, uh, whenever I get to 1,000 subscribers, I can make those community posts on YouTube. Because uh, if you're not following me on Twitter, which you absolutely should, at CoachMax19, no spaces, uh, you absolutely should follow me there. You'll see when I'm going live with streaming. But the main reason that I don't stream a ton is... Not that many people follow me on... Oh, there's one person you can battle here if you walk in a straight line. I need to make sure I don't battle him. 
I just don't want to run the risk of anything terrible happening. But, um... One of the reasons I don't stream is I don't have a ton of people following me on Twitter. And so the odds of people actually listening or watching a stream that follow me is very, very slim. And so it's just it's just one of those personal things that I... Uh, it's just one of those personal things. But if you go follow me on Twitter at CoachMax19, I would definitely be inspired to do more streaming, especially since we're in quarantine and we've got nowhere to go. Uh, guys, I drove a car yesterday for the first time in a very long while, and it was it was a little weird. Uh, obviously, I didn't forget how to drive, but it was weird, having not gone anywhere in so, so long. Uh, also, I'm hugging the walls to avoid any random battles. There is one battle, one more battle I can't avoid, and then I'll make it out of this tunnel alive. And then we'll be good. But uh, this quarantine stuff, it's a... Uh, it's interesting, that's for sure. Let me know down in the comments what you've been doing during all this quarantine business. Uh, personally, I've been working on the channel a whole lot, getting these Nuzlocke episodes out, and working on other videos, getting at least a video a week, which is insane for me to accomplish normally. I just don't have the time with uh, school. But also, I've been playing guitar a little bit, and uh, if you didn't know, I play guitar. Uh, I'm not great at it. But I know a little bit of it, but I've been practicing it a little bit, and it feels really good to get back into it. But if you play guitar, you know what I'm talking about. The finger calluses that you build up just from pressing down on the strings, man, they really get you sometimes. That's for sure. Alright, Anakin. Let's take out this Oddish, because we're almost out of the cave at this point. I wasn't expecting to get through the cave this quickly. I've just, see, I've done this game so many times that I just know my brain goes on autopilot to get through the caves. Uh, Victory Road is one of those caves that I hated growing up because I could just never remember the exact way to get through it. But now I remember how to get through it, and it's no issue at all, which is very nice. But, you know, just one of those things. <coughs> Let's see. Let's go Fury Attack. Let's see how much more damage that does than Peck. Also, just a sneak peek into the future, I have come up with ideas for doing uh, these challenge runs in Pokemon Stadium, one of which is taking the Pokemon that have the lowest base stats out of every Pokemon in Gen 1. Uh, I have Pokemon Stadium 1 and 2, but also, you want an Aether or an Elixir? A Max Aether, that's what's here. If you ever see an, a little rock standing by itself, odds are that's what's going on there. But uh, taking the Pokemon with the lowest base stats and making a team with them and seeing how far in Gym Leader Castle is. Also, do you guys uh, hear that creepy music? Hmm. Must have just been me. But going through Gym Leader Castle, and if you've not played Pokemon Stadium, then you have no idea what I'm talking about, but that's okay. Uh, going through there and trying just with the weakest team that we possibly could. There's only so many things I could do. Uh, also, Magikarp would be included in that, and Magikarp only has Splash. It doesn't even get Tackle in Pokemon Stadium. Maybe it does, but still, I would only have Tackle. So, I'll, I'll play around with that one a little bit. Another idea that I've come up with, uh, I don't want to just go from Nuzlocke to Nuzlocke. There's other games that I would like to play on the channel, uh, different different games, different types of ones, but one thing I'd like to do on Pokemon Stadium, and I could do this on a stream would be probably better for it, is go through and randomly generate a number between 1 and 250 in Pokemon Stadium 2, and make a team using those six randomly generated numbers. That was a long animation for seeing, goodness. How long am I going to be asleep? Please don't be a good while. You know what, let's just, uh... Let's just forego this painful situation and bring Anakin on in here. Anakin is probably going to be the one to uh, do all the heavy lifting in Erica's gym, so I want to make sure he's uh, up to snuff. Ha! Can't handle this. There we 
we go. I said I was going to end the episode. Actually, I know what I'll do to end the episode. Instead of just battling this person, I'm going to take... Uh, I'm going to go back to the end of Rock Tunnel and battle those trainers. Because those trainers will give some good XP for uh, for good, good old Anakin. And then we'll call it a day. I, I got to tell y'all, I have been shocked by uh, how many people have been watching the Nuzlocke. Uh, personally, I feel very flustered recording it sometimes. Typically the first episode in a recording session, because I have to get back into the swing of it, of going through. But then typically the next episode, I'm like, hey, this is fun. You know, no big deal. It's fun right now. But I, I remember what to say. <laughs> My brain shuts off sometimes. Don't know if that ever happens to you, but uh, it's a little, little not fun when it happens. Anyways, this is the first episode of this stream of videos, and so I'm going to try to get about five of them done. Uh, it just depends. It's you, it's just part of a... It's interesting. Something you don't ever think about. Ooh, Slowpoke. You almost cost us green Pikmin earlier. But this time we got him for sure. Okay, I was just ready for, like, a random, insane critical hit chance <laughs> going on right there. Uh, another video I have, uh, idea I have going is on Gen 2, and it's actually a, a video, not so much a... What's it called? Not so much just a uh, run video, but uh, I rearranged my setup. Uh, you can find in some of my early early videos. Ooh, Onyx. Well, uh, let's bring old Green Pikmin back out. I don't want to see... Wayne will not be any good in Erica's gym with water typing. Green Pikmin, should things go poorly with Anakin, at least will be a, a, a high level. I hate having to rely on that, but that's just kind of how it is. But see, high levels? It's getting us there. Uh, if you go back to some of my old, old videos, like my Avengers Endgame review or the Detective Pikachu review, you can see the setup that I had, and it's just, it, it didn't look like a bad setup at all, but it was very amateurish. And, uh, guys, I watched one of my videos the other day from a long time ago. It was the Toy Story 2 video, actually. Um, I remember being so incredibly proud of that video when it came out. And while working on it, like, I think it was, it was one of my favorites. And then I watched it the other day. And guys, it's not very good. I hate to, hate to break that one to you. It's not awful. But I definitely wasn't comfortable talking into the microphone yet. Uh, I wasn't comfortable with writing a lot of things in the script by that point. And it's just, it's crazy to just see the, the style change over time. Uh, also, it's just, I had so many other videos along that line planned, and then school started back up, and then I started the Pokemon Challenge videos, and then I started getting subscribers. Uh, Pokemon is one of my favorite video, like, video games. I just never wanted to be exclusively a PokeTuber, but then in the past, uh, past few months, well, <laughs> here we are. You know how the story goes. Atta boy, Anakin, getting to level 25. Mirror move. Um, let me see. Is there a move that I can get rid of? Um, let's... What well, will help me out here, actually? Mirror move would be a very niche move to use, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna put that one on Anakin anyways. Just to, uh, just to see what happens with it. But the video on Gen 2 would be about how uh, a lot of Gen 2 is uh, kind of forgotten. And uh, that's probably better explained in a video when the video happens. And so, here's what we're going to call it for this video. Make sure that you subscribe on the channel and leave a like on the video. Make sure you leave a comment because all those things help out with the channel a whole lot. I don't like begging for them, but I'm always going to put these things at the end of the video. I'm never going to say make sure you leave a like on the video at the beginning of the video because, uh, <laughs> what if you don't like the video? But anyways, make sure that you leave a like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos 
here on Coach Max Entertainment. And until next time, see you later.